Only on Way 31, a firestorm of controversy surrounding a Huntsville Middle School teacher and drag performer who was caught on a live stream making comments during a recent drag queen story hour that some find inappropriate for kids. That event, hosted by a Huntsville Animal Rescue Group, not on school property. Senior reporter Matt Kroschel joins us live now from Mountain Gap Middle School, where that performer, James Miller, has taught for the past four years. And tonight, the school's responding to this story going viral around the country. Matt saying they are conducting a thorough review of the situation. Dan, J James Miller goes by the stage name of Majesty Divine. He's been in education for 27 years, and for 22 years, he has been a performer on the side, working in clubs and other venues across the state of Alabama. He says that at no time during those 22 years has that interfered with his education career, but that may be changing. A story by that right-wing social media account, Libs of TikTok, accused Miller of making lewd sexual innuendo and jokes to a room full of children. The story picked up by other national media outlets overnight. Now Miller says he's being threatened and his personal information posted online alongside with those hundreds of emails and threats that continue to pour in. Tonight, a parent who was at one of those shows in question is defending Miller. My little girl, for sure. She's at every drag queen story time. And did you as a parent have concerns about the comment that was made or things that were said during any of those? Did you ever feel like there's something that we're crossing the line or, or there's something that maybe my child shouldn't be here? Absolutely not. And if you actually listen to the video, whenever um, Madge makes the comment about the hot dogs, I think it's that one. You can hear chuckling in the back. That was me laughing. That parent is also on the board there at the nonprofit. The owners of the nonprofit telling me they have had to alert Madison County Sheriff's Office and the FBI, and they've increased security at their facility in light of the recent threats since the original story was posted on Wednesday. Now, the nonprofit says they are still committed to providing this type of programming at their facility, and they are moving forward with another story time hosted by Majesty Divine scheduled for next month. Reporting live in Huntsville, Matt Kroschel, Way 31 News.